In today's episode, I'm going to do an updated review on one of my favorite shoes for all of my outdoor adventures. Not only are these shoes great for fishing, they're also great for kayaking, working out, camping, and hiking. Stay tuned. Cross Kicks Water Shoes, the pros, the cons, the versatility of its applications, and hopefully this video will give you the information that you need to make sure that this shoe is right for you. Not only that, but if you do find that this shoe is right for you, I'm going to give you a hell of a deal with a 35% off discount through the link in the description below. However, if you do miss the window for the 35% off, you can always click my link below, visit the site, and type in Tig's Tales 20 for a 20% discount on the shoe. Let's get on them. All right, y'all, let's start with the pros. First of all, these shoes are meant to get dirty. And the best thing about getting them dirty is that they're super easy to clean. All you have to do is put them under some running water and boom, brand new shoe. The next pro I want to discuss is comfort. These shoes are super comfy. They are made of EVA foam, which actually mold to your feet after extended use, which is really awesome. They also have a foam heel pad for added comfort so these shoes are great for everyday use they're flexible they're durable and they're lightweight cross kicks also have a non-marking tread on the bottom of the shoe and also a non-slip grip on the shoes so they're great for wearing indoors as well as outdoors in the outdoors they grip really well to rock or any kind of terrain that you might encounter so now let's discuss the functionality of these shoes. As the water comes in the top of the shoe, it actually gets dispersed through the holes that you'll see on the side and also on the bottom of the shoe, which is great because it actually helps keep your feet dry or dry more quickly. This brings me to one of the cons of the shoe is that you'll see on the uh, holes, if you're in any kind of water that holds any kind of sediment or sand or rocks, they tend to uh, get into the shoe via these vents. So that's definitely a con. What you can do though is either wear socks to stop them from penetrating trading as much or if you'd like you could just sort of uh, take your shoe slightly off and let that water run through and it'll clear out those rocks for you but definitely a con for me considering that you know comfort is key but having that sand in there really does uh, some injustice to the shoe so cross kicks has two different types of shoes the first is going to be the apx or the all-purpose kicks this is what they consider their everyday shoe just shoes that you can wear about on a daily basis they come in a multitude of colors and also a multitude of sizes and then the other version is the 2.0 this is the more sportier of the two shoes i would probably use this when i'm fishing or outdoors um hiking camping things like that this is a shoe that has has a larger width to it so if you have a wide foot this might be a better option for you so overall I give these shoes an excellent rating they can be used for multiple applications as I had mentioned earlier fishing hiking working out running camping they're just an overall great shoe I appreciate all of you watching and I hope this information was helpful to you and we'll catch you on the next video.